Hey Luis, show us your Indian dance. <laughs> hey guys, so we are here at this Indian place. And what do I hear? Hey, bro, what are you gonna get? With this, with this music, bro? Un pinche plato de asada. Unos taquitos. Do you know what you're gonna get, bro? Chicken nuggets. Hey, they do. They got alcohol, bro. Should we, should we get some? Mmm, I don't know. Alcohol's pretty average. I'm not really feeling. It's a Monday. I'm not trying to get too turned on Monday. Hey, bro, look. They fancy here. All right, guys. So I'm not really sure what a lot of these things are on this menu. But I have decided that I'm gonna get tour of tan doors, <clears throat> chicken paneer shrimp and fish tiki taka. Louis, tell us a little bit about some, about what you got. Ving, it was like vindaloo. Yeah, I said it was meat with potatoes. I think that's it. They have like this little thing under the table. Helicopter, helicopter. That's the platter, isn't it? Yeah, this is the, 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 I forget what it's called. All right, but what is this? Well, I really hope this isn't like mugre. Well, let's start off with the camaroncito. Oh, it's a pescado. Mmm. Mmm, what's up? Really white, too. I'm, I'm curious to what this is. What is it? <laughs> is it good? Oh, I don't really like it. Is this fish? Is that chicken? I don't know what this is. This is chicken. I'm gonna be honest with you. What? I'm not impressed. No? No, not really. All the, the food, the, all the flavors are like really like earthy. <laughs> like earthy, it tastes like, like dry herbs. Very rooty taste. I like the rice though. Like a six. Six out of ten. I mean, it's good. Fish is good. Mm. I'm not eating that. I'm showing you right now, I'm not eating that. You wanna try some? Sure. We'll see, uh, <clears throat> we'll see what happens. Yes, sir. Why is it moving like that? Put it arroz. La Rosito. It looks like birria to me, but give it a try and tell me what, what you think. Do you think I should put it? You should, yeah. Mm, it tastes like caldo de res. Caldo de res? <laughs> what? Ahí está, raza. Un caldito de res indio. All right, bro. So we like a lot of a lot of bites in. This too. This is pretty good. The goat or what is it, lamb? No, it's lamb. The lamb is like strong, but either way, lamb's always strong. So if you don't like lamb, <coughs> it's not for you. Yeah. The chicken. I think you would go safe with the chicken, and this thing would be really, really good. Or some lamb is, lamb's are, It's actually kind of spicy, bro. No, oh, really? Like a little bit, not a lot, but a little bit. We got some. Blocks of cheese. Yeah, bro, that, that tasted weird. It doesn't really have much flavor to it. Like, it's just cheese. All right, we could be wrong. It might not be cheese. I don't know. These sauces oh, yeah. are really weird. This one doesn't really taste like anything. Anything. This, this one, one is like a like a light barbecue kind mm -hmm. of. A little tangy barbecue. Mm -hmm. A little update. We just asked the waitress. She said this is actually tamarindo sauce. Yeah, and like, that one was good. This one 
Is salsa de tamarindo? This is a Mexican's weakness right here. We, like, they need a bottle of this up. Before we knew what it was, we liked that one. Mm, yeah. I, I can see it now. Yeah. Indication now. And then tell them what this one was. This is menta. Mint leaves. Mint. It doesn't really taste like anything. This one's good though. Yeah. The tamarindo sauce. Tamarindo one? That's a first. Not even Mexicans do that. Everything has a really earthy, herbal taste. It's a, it's, it was worth a try. I mean, we've never had Indian, Indian food. food. And now we can say that we had. I, I think next time I'll try that, that chicken that she recommended. The first yeah, round. the butter chicken. Mm -hmm. But, mm, I guess we just gotta finish our food and go home. We'll go home. So, the food was really good. <coughs> I'm just kidding. It was alright. It was okay. Um, not my, uh, not my cup of tea, but. It was uh, different. Yeah. Very different from what there's we a lot of people eat. there eating there, you know. A lot of, a lot of you can, Caucasian people. So for me, it just wasn't it. Like we had to go with the plan B. One of the things I really liked about it though was that that tamarindo sauce. That tamarindo sauce had like just the right consistency, the the right the, the right it's amount like of spice. It's like a barbecue sauce, but way better. Yeah, like I've never tried anything like that in my life. I'm Mexican. Like we had tamarindo candies, tamarindo we had, paste. We had a tamarindo. I want tamarindo. And never in my life did anybody ever say, "Here you go, bro." Have some tamarindo. Have some tamarindo sauce. And the place also looked very nice, but they also had like a this one like place where it was like a big ass TV screen. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And they were playing like Indian music. It was pretty cool, but we got sat at the booth, and then they also had a bar. And the whole place, like the vibe was cool. It's just the food was like okay. Yeah, cut the or maybe we just don't know good Indian, like you know, plates. True. I think it would have been better if I didn't get the lamb because lamb is strong. So if I would have gotten chicken, I think it would have been way better. But either way, it was still okay. They gave you three choices of like uh, mild, medium, or hot. Mm. And I got medium, and it wasn't. It wasn't hot at all, actually. For that bowl of. Of goat wiener and the variety plate that I got. It was fifty dollars. Fifty bucks. Pretty pricey. That was our our Indian review. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. For more videos. Adios.